What's up, guys? Danny here from The Lassercast, and I know that I had promised to do a review of Joe Bob's Halloween Hoedown, but Thursday night and Saturday, I went to New York Comic Con with my family, and sandwiched in the middle there was a very long day of work and spirit Halloween shopping, and I just couldn't stay awake, and I feel bad. So as a penance, I'm going to do a quick review of VHS 94, a really cool new uh, found footage horror anthology streaming on Shudder. This movie was made by like a who's who of all of the it people in the horror community right now. Simon Barrett directed one of the segments. He directed one called The Empty Wake. Uh, and he just has a film right now up on Shudder called Seance. I did a short review of that for this channel. Uh, Timo Tijanto an amazing Indonesian filmmaker who did films like May the Devil Take You, The Night Comes For Us. He has a segment in here called The Subject. And let me tell you something, that man should be given the right to do a Tetsuo the Iron Man uh, remake because The Subject was one of the coolest things I have seen and I wanted more of it. Uh, just a blending of... Uh, human and machine. Uh, I, I once bought, blind bought a movie called Machine Girl, this Japanese film called Machine Girl, because it looked crazy like this. And yeah, love this segment. Also love the segment by Chloe Akuno called Storm Drain, uh, about a news crew hunting in a storm drain for this, uh, they call it the Loch Ness Monster of this town, uh, The Rat Man. They think, you know, there's this like rat monster, half human rat man stalking around. And at first you're thinking, where is this really going? And then you see where it's going and you're like, wow, okay. I could actually deal with that as a full length movie as well. Um, there's also a, a really fun twist on the, uh, you know, uh, militia cult kind of thing. Uh, at the end, uh, done by Ryan Prowse in, a, in a, a, something called... Uh, a a segment called Terror. There is not a slow moment in this. Every segment in VHS 94 is really good, is really fun. There are some jumps. And, and that's what I love about found footage. I know found footage isn't for everybody, but I feel like found footage is the only genre of horror that doesn't really have to try to get its jump scares out. And the jump scares actually are warranted because you're looking at the perspective, the first person perspective of the camera. So you're turning into something coming at you and it, it feels legitimate to me. I don't know. I, I love found footage. I was one of those people at 17, 18 years old, I saw Blair Witch Project in the movie theater and I loved it. And I, I will defend that movie to the, to the end of day, the end of days. Um, this movie is produced by a, another just who's who, uh, Brad Miska and David Bruckner. Brad Miska, uh, produced the original VHS trilogy. David Bruckner, uh, just did The Night House, which I reviewed on this channel and, uh, Pete has a review over on the Anchor Pete channel as well. He has He's directing the new Hellraiser movie. Uh, it's also produced by some of the guys from Shudder, Craig Engler and Sam Zimmerman. And also Radio Silence helped produce this. Radio Silence, uh, they were, I think, executive producers. They're the ones that did Ready or Not, which was one of my favorite horror films of the last few years. This is a who's who of modern horror. If you like the anthology style and if you like found footage, you are going to love this movie. Uh, friend of the channel, Stephen Kostansky, we have an interview with him on our channel. Um, we reviewed Psycho Gorman. We love that movie. He even has a very small little segment here. He directs one of the commercials uh, that is shown on like the grainy VHS footage, which is really funny. Uh, so yeah, check out VHS 94. It is streaming now on Shudder. And stay tuned because Charlotte and I are going to have a review of Halloween 2 coming up. Speaking of Halloween, bought my tickets this morning for Halloween Kills. Cannot wait. Thursday night show. I'll have a review up by Friday morning. Non-spoiler, of course. And speaking of Halloween, right now on our channel, I interviewed Sandy King Carpenter, uh, the runner of uh, the person who basically runs Storm King Comics, along with her husband, John Carpenter. Uh, they have a ton of new stuff. They're at New York Comic Con right now. I sat with her at New York Comic Con yesterday. 
and delightful woman gave me a few minutes talked about all the new comics that they have their new tales from a halloween night uh they're up to uh, volume seven of that and she does a story to bookend the book with john carpenter who always does a story at the beginning of the book so check out that interview uh give that a like give our channel a like and a subscribe and we'll have a plenty of more coming this october but Go check out VHS 94 and then leave a comment and tell me what you think. Hell Rahman.